Yeah, why do learning standards matter? That's a good question. Let, let, let me begin with the definition though first. Learning standard is a definite level of achievement or excellence that has been agreed upon, whether it's by consensus or custom or authority. It's saying what is the, the standard that has to be achieved. Um, such as you know qualifying for the for the Olympic high jump for women is 1.96 meters. So you you can't play in that field if you don't get above 1.96. Now, why do we need standards? Um, well, first and most obviously, if you know the standard, you know what you need to do to improve to get there. So improving is the first reason. The second reason is accountability. Now, there's two aspects of accountability. First of all, there's there's value for money. So lots of people are spending money in higher education, whether that's students or parents or governments or organisations. Um, they, they're spending money and they want to know, is this a, a good value for, for the money that's being spent? And then the other aspect of reliability is the uh, reliability or accountability is, is that people can rely on this credential when making decisions. So for example, uh, if an employer is going to employ somebody, they want to know that the that the graduate has met these learning standards. They want, if you're a professional body, you want to know that they've met particular uh, standards as well in order to become a member or to enter the professional program after your higher education degree. If you're uh, um, another institution, higher education institution, and you're taking on a master's or a PhD student, you want to know have the the undergraduates met the learning standards that that uh, are necessary, and and another one is is government. I mean, the Australian government's interested in uh, the the reliability of our credentials because this affects the export industry for Australia. It's, it, higher education is the forty fourth highest export industry, and of the other three, uh, iron ore. Um, coal and gold, you can measure the quality precisely, but you can't measure the quality precisely of higher education. The government has instituted the um, higher education uh, regulator called TEXA, the Tertiary Education Quality and Standards Agency, and one uh, or several of their, their higher education standards actually talk about that the course has been designed with a view to what are the external standards and secondly that there is evidence that these standards have been uh, achieved internally and that ex there's also seen, been some benchmarking somebody else has looked at, looked at it in the sense to say yes they've achieved that particular standard. If we develop discipline standards that reflect the Australian qualifications framework and the standards are a the generic bachelor and masters and and the international standards um, then really what that means is that higher education providers and, and students and parents and employers they know what they can expect from the, the standards so setting the standards matters now we've really already done it for accounting and marketing and economics and business and we've got others on the boil and there's a plethora of other disciplines in Australia that have set standards as well. Science, law, engineering, um, geography, history, blah, etc. Now in the UK they've done, been on this journey for uh, since the year 2000 and there's 76 dis disciplines that have done it. Now then comes the question, um, how do each, how does each higher education provider then develop those capabilities? Uh, and what we want to make sure that the that we retain diversity, and that each 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 uh, provider can retain their niche and develop students so that they want to take a you know a private sector focus or a uh, international focus or a quantitative focus or whatever it is that they can do that. It shouldn't matter how they achieve it. So learning standards matter to sum up for two reasons. One, um, you can improve when you know what the standard is that you need to get to. And secondly, because uh, 
accountability for one of those five or six types of stakeholders who are interested in relying on the output of higher education. Cheers. <laughs>